G'day Saints fans and welcome to another edition of The Engine Room. On the weekend against the Brisbane Lions, we tried to attack the top of the square and get numbers front and square and kick some goals. We were able to do this on a number of occasions on the weekend and here we'll show you some examples. The first was in the second quarter where Jack Stephen here puts the ball in. If we go back Luke Dunstan who was at the, in the midfield, couldn't get used so he works really hard to get front and square. Josh Bruce at the same time caused a trivia contest and Luke, who worked from the midfield, inside 50, was able to get on the end of it and snap a terrific goal. The second example again, we see here Blake Akers doesn't mess around with the footy, attacks the goals. We see lots of numbers in the contest. Maverick Weller does a terrific job here to get front and square right across the chest of the contest as the player unfolds and a terrific front and square. He doesn't blaze away, he gives the handball and Nick Rewald, who actually competed in that contest, follows up and kicks the goal. Yeah, this next one is similar to the first two that Joe saw. Predictable kick by Nunes to the top of the square. If you hold it there, you get a really good contest. You see that Armitage here and you see that Joe is queued up at the front of the contest. Now if we hold it right there. Now Joe, would you call that this is an assist? I'll just get a fingernail in. <laughs> <laughs> Joe gets a fingernail in, he starts off at the front. But we've got two players importantly queuing up the front. Uh, Joey has an impact on this one but Armitage is able to run on from the front position and crumb the ball. The next one is a little bit unique. It's different to the first couple, but it's still really good technique by Adam Snyder. Joey's outside 50. If you hold it there. Okay, so you see the tall, the tall timber who we're going to kick it to, and you see Snyder here. The first three contests, blokes have been a fair way from the ball, and they've hit the, had to hit the front of the contest at pace. This time there's not really um, many places for Snyder to go, so he has to stay in the contest and he basically just camps at the feet of the big man. So you can see that he stops there and he ends up at the front, off the chest, and because he didn't blaze through that at 100 miles an hour, he was able to stay in the contest, get a clean grab at it and kick an important goal for the Saints. So again, you've seen another basic skill, but when applied properly, it can really help us win games of football. And our front and square work on the weekend was terrific. Thanks for watching this week's edition of The Engine Room.